Health leaders with the Richmond and Rico Health District tell me that things went pretty well on the first day with nearly 100 kids getting vaccinated right here in the Richmond and Rico Health District as they prepare to roll out more doses of the vaccine next week. Now, health leaders with the RRHD tell me that about 80 children aged 5 through 11 were able to get va- get the vaccine at the Richmond Raceway and around 16 community 16 of them were at the community hubs in downtown meanwhile state health leaders tell me that 1290 children were vaccinated yesterday here in virginia at statewide community vaccination centers however they are still waiting on totals from pharmacies and pediatricians the children's version of the shot is a third of what older age groups get just with smaller needles and distinctive orange packaging and health leaders with RRHD say they're partnering with RPS and Henrico schools now for vaccine events over the next few weekends in hopes of getting uh, vaccinating at least 500 kids at each one. And we're really excited for these events because we know that the school systems are such an important partner. Uh, So many parents feel very connected to their school systems. It's a great way to get information. It's a great way to offer vaccines in a place that's very accessible to kids that they might be a little bit familiar with already. Now, those events will be taking place over the next few Saturdays from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. Meanwhile, the mass vaccination clinic at the Richmond Raceway will be moving to the Arthur Ashe Center starting next week. We will have more information on that as well as where you can sign up for an appointment for your child on our website at WTVR.com. Working for you in Richmond, I'm Matthew Foltz, CBS 6 News.